What we got? Primate Golduck, Pidgeot, Arcanine, Electro Gengar. Here we go. I'm going to show you guys a sick Aerodactyl new meta. Get those new meta horns roaring because I'm going to show you guys something sick with Aerodactyl. You're never going to believe this at all in your life. It's going to be so good. Oh, it depends on what he weeds with, though. Depends on what he weeds with. Because this could actually go very, very well for me. Or it could super backfire. But I think this is the type of, like, you know, meta-progressing strategies that we need to make Let's Go super competitive. I wonder if you guys can guess. What do you guys think the Aerodactyl moveset we're using today is? What do you guys think it is? I bet you you've never seen it. I bet you you've never seen it in your life. And we'll see. We'll figure it out. Which game do you think is better? Heart Gold, Soul Silver, or Let's Go? I think Let's Go is way better. Let's Go is way better. Alright, what do you got, Chief? Show me that electrode. Arcanine, y'all take it. I'll take an Arcanine lead, please. Sign me up for one Arcanine lead, please. He really thought we were moving with Doug Trio or Venusaur. Venus was actually a pretty decent lead against him, but yo, Aerodactyl popping off as always. Now, what move do you think we're gonna be using first? Give me a hint, it's not Stealth Rock. Look at this juicy Aerodactyl moveset. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. You see that? See that first move? Aw, oh, it's so good. We're not using it right now. But I might. Oh, give me the big damage. I'm not going to Mega right now. Show me a will o -Wisp. Show me will o -Wisp, please. Oh, show me that one. No! No, you're supposed to hit me! No! 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 No, he missed! He missed! Never lucky. I was gonna win. I mean, I'm a rock slide again, so like maybe I'll miss and he'll do it again. Oh, he's withdrawn. Damn it. You can't say I don't play the game and I wasn't prepared for this. You cannot tell me I was not 100% prepared for this to happen. Alright. Do you guys think he's gonna Thunder Wave or just Thunderbolt me? I could Mega with Aerodactyl and just like win. I will. We'll go for a speed tie rock slide KO. Can't believe he missed that Will was. Epic facade sweep? I mean it's possible he still goes for like a Thunder Wave. We're gonna Mega Evolve to get the additional damage on Rock Slide. Potentially go for speed ties and uh, try and win this one out right now. Go Mega now. I bet he hard Thunderbolt, but Thunderbolt won't do enough damage, guys. Thunder Wave is the correct play to stop the bleeding here. Rock Slide, we win the speed ties, we make the connection, we get the additional damage boost, and we take out that Electro. No, I'm saying. Oh, man, I really want that guy to hit his Will o Wisp. That would have been so sick. Oh, well. That would have been so cool. You, you know how much stronger like a facade, just a regular facade is than like a, th uh, a Rock Slide? You guys think you have Aerodactyl Calcs? Like, nah, fam, it's so good. Please scald me. Please scald burn me so I can use my strat. That's a we playing. Oh, are we playing? Yo, my friend. That will was miss? You should have went for it. I, I wanted you to hit it. I wanted you to hit the will o -Wisp. Please burn me, chief. Please burn me. Please burn me. Please. Please burn me. Please. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, it's time. Oh, it is fucking time. Here we go. Yo, we're about to be popping off. You see, you see how that rock slide didn't do enough damage? You see how it just didn't do enough damage? Yo, we have enough damage. Because we got the facade Aerodactyl. Oh my goodness, giving us the chaos. <laughs> Slow Cook, how's it going, Chief? Yeah, that's right. Oh my gosh, that's, that's right. awesome. Yo, thank you for the follow as well. Really appreciate it. Looks like you have uh, some of Whiskey's emotes too. That's really, really cool. But the facade Aerodactyl, like, burn me more, Snake. If any of you guys are Metagross Solid fans. Gengar? I mean, I guess you can send out Gengar. I'm about to switch. Like, I can still use this thing for, I can get like two more KOs with this thing. I can get two more KOs with this thing. I'm just going to leave. I don't want him sending sub. I can taunt through sub. Give us a sweep. Uh, I can't hit the Gengar, guys. I'll, it'll be back. He can still finish off like two of his mons. There you go in here. 
We break the wrist here. Mega Drain. We block those. That's a good... That's, Mega Drain's the right play in that situation. I always say, like, don't say, don't show Mega Drain until you actually have to, but he wanted to heal the crunch damage. And I think I'm just gonna go for... I'm just gonna go for the Thunder, yo. Show me that damage. Show me that big damage. Electrode. Show him what you're working with right now. He's going Mega Gengar. Oh, he's risking it for the biscuit. He is indeed. He is indeedy. Risking it for the biscuit. Let's go, Thunder. Oh my goodness. Craig has a 110 base. Super, not super effective. 110 base stab. Can we get a pair? Never lucky. Never lucky. And this should get a KO. Yep. That's a strong move. Very strong move. I want to be a psychic on that guy, too. Highly possible. Shadow Ball, I think, KOs our Doug Trio. But I'm going to send Doug Trio anyways. Da -da -da Doug Trio. I think I'm going to Sucker Punch. Yep. Su -su -su sucker Punch. SPSP, -S baby. Let's see if he subs here. Uh, the fact that he showed Mega Drain is giving me, like, the additional info I need to make sure he doesn't have something Shadow Ball. Mega Drain. Oh, my goodness. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. He has enough help to sub down, but like we've seen, Shadow Ball, Sludge Bomb, Mega Drain. I think his last move is Psychic. And does he have any priority moves in the back? He does not. So we're just going to go for another one. And if he has sub, he can totally use it. Yeah, you know, he can totally use sub. He's withdrawing. That's totally fine. We saw that Gen Gengar can get killed by uh, Aerodactyl here. The Arcanine? Pidgeot. Oh my goodness. So good. What a cool Pokemon, yo. SP block, yo. SPF 30. We're coming in here with, hot with a rock slide. Rock slide, making the connections. Super effective. Can we take this guy to Flinchtown? Survey says we take him to Flinchtown one time. Can we go one more? Can we go for another one? Another one. Rock slide. Can we get some high rolls here? Rock's emotes up in chat. Can we take Flinchtown part two? Roost. Oh my goodness. Yo, this guy's going to try and wall us out, chat. going to try and wall us out. Roost Pidget, yo. He heals a little bit more than ideal as well. So, like, we gotta get another flinch. And we only have eight rock slides because, like, um, Filthy Casual I didn't PP max this Doug Trio. So, can we get another flinch? Survey says. Bruce, no. Oof. Yo, we're. This is, is kind of scary. Because eventually I'm gonna have to switch because, like, I don't have enough rock slides, you know? I think he should just switch to Primate, guys. Switch to Primate, switch back to Pidget. It wasted my rock slides. Rock slide. Come on. Come on, rock slide. Give me a crit. Come on, come on. Flinch, that's what I'm talking about, yo. And I got I just gotta hit this rock slide. And I can't go for sucker punch because he's roosting. Rock slide. Oh, we take him. Flinch down. OP. You can't wall what you can't see, Chief. And we know he has prime move in the back. So I think I'm just going to Probably just EQ. I think I'm probably just gonna EQ. And then send out Aerodactyl and clean sweep him up. There's the prime move. It's almost like I play the game. Almost like I play the game. EQ, EQ, baby. Show me what you're working with. It's gonna be decent damage here too. It's gonna be pretty decent damage. I would say it's almost. It's gonna do almost half. I would say. There's the EQ. I wonder if he's just going for like a low kick or an earthquake. A little bit over half. Prime is such a cool Pokemon. I love Primeape. Brick Break, yo, Brick Break. I like Brick Break more than Low Kick, actually. Just my opinion. I like, guess always gonna have a Brick Break Pokemon in your team to break some screens. Very, very good strat. But, yo, we are going to resume our sweep where we left off. We are going to resume the big sweep, yo. Aerodactyl coming in. Humongous. And let's go for it. Let's go, Aerodactyl. You guys saw what I clicked. That's right. He's show, show me Gengar. He's trying to time me. He's trying to burn me out. Oh, he switched to Gengar. Guys, it's almost like I played the game. Because I knew you were switching in that Gengar. And I might be burned, right? But I am a mega Aerodactyl. And I am stabbing this. And it is still not enough to get a KO. <laughs> oh my gosh, that doesn't KO. That's pretty raw. But like, you know. What other move was I supposed to use in that situation? I mean, I actually kind of want to rock slide here. Because he could switch to Arcanine. So I will. Rock slides up, yo. Rock slide. He stayed in. We make our connections, yo. Facade, who needs it? I did that in case he wanted to switch to Arcanine to, like, uh, tick me out from burn. Because, like, Arcanine, Gengar, Pyramid makes a like, perfect, like, switch thing. Like, I, I want to facade the Arcanine. And so, like, Gengar covers that. And I want to, like, rock slide the Arcanine. And I want to, like, 
wing attack the primate and I want to crunch the Gengar and there's so many other like different scenarios but we are going to be able I think to get this one one and done because we got the big facade coming in here facade Aerodactyl OP you heard it here first guys I think this game actually would have went better for me if he actually got that burn first turn good game GG yo thank you so much for the games my friend and facade Aerodactyl I told you guys we were going to get the facade Aerodactyl sweep like, right from the start, I was like, oh my gosh, if he goes for the wool, was is going to be hilarious. And we'd be taking those. Bam. You get a facade. You get a facade. Oh my goodness. Facade squad Aerodactyl. Overpowered. It works even if like, they paralyze us too. It's super good. But thank you for the game, my friend. Hopefully you had a good one. I know I got a couple lucky flinches, but it was still a lot of fun. Yo, All Might. This guy is busting out the All Might. He's, so Mew's like the hardest Pokemon to play around. I think we're just going to need Electrode. And I think I will actually just go for like a Rocks. I got, or a Taunt. And if he's like, well, you could just Earthquake. It's like, well then, do it. You know what I mean? People DC get them thick L's. Yo, I feel it. This guy's a very good team. Can you say run? Oh my gosh, yeah. Oh, man, that's a good song. All the My Hero music is really good. Like, there's a there's actually an acoustic version, like an Orstal version of You Say Run that's on, like, uh, YouTube and stuff. It's one of my favorite songs. Yeah, this guy is Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. I'd like to set rocks on this guy, but I really feel this team's, like, really one-dimensional. So it really tunnels me into having very specific checks to very specific Pokemon. And it's going to be hard. It's going to be hard to, like, break through this. The Nidoqueen is a big problem. And the Gyarados is a problem. He's leading Ninetales. Nine tails lead. What is he trying to check with nine tails? Uh, maybe Doug Trio? Oh, he's trying to check Venusaur lead. So he thinks I was going to lead Venusaur. That means he's not confident in his Mew. I mean, I'm just going to. Do I just want to taunt this? I'm just going to taunt it. Uh, I'm not. I don't care if he, like, blizzards me or ice beams me. And I don't want him to calm mind or sub. So I'm just going to taunt it. Yeah, Ice Beam is totally fine. I'm just going to switch in Lapras, probably. Yep. And I can't use my Alakazam until he gets rid of the Gyarados, guys. Let's see. It. It's the Gyarados is a big problem. Gyarados is a really big problem right now. So, let's see. We might have to go Mega Aerodactyl this game. I don't really want to. Made it to the stream. What moves that you have on Lapras? I'm going to show you right now, Chief. What you, what, show you what you're working with. Nido Queen versus Lapras. Place your bets. Place your breaths. Brought his nine tails to an electrode party. I know, right? Yo, it's time. Waterfall. Megahorn drew a run. Ice shard waterfall. We got that adamant physical Lapras. And you can go for your rocks here, Chief. You can totally stealth rocks me. Because once I get this thing off the board, I'm going to be fine. I'm going to be fine. It's going to be so much easier to use, uh, like, my Aerodactyl. So, come on, Lapras. Survey says, big waterfall. Do you guys think ice shard KOs from here? Let me actually run some calcs. That waterfall is an 80 base power move. I think Ice Shard has potential to KO if that's a low roll waterfall. Because that did about 68%. 65 to 68. And so that would mean he's at like 32%. And so if we cut the 65 in half, it's roughly 30 to 32%, which is looks like what he's at. And this is that. Ice Shard will be very close. I'm going to go for it. Let's roll the dice, Lapras. Show me that damage. Oh my gosh, we take those. Oh, the calcs, yo. We be taking those. Math. Yo, the math of the test right there. I feel that the, the first waterfall was a little bit of a roll, roll roll. And so if we take an average roll, we got it. Like, we take those. Got that physical Lapras. OP. OP, OP. Yo, we be taking those. We be taking those. Nine tails? Yo. You already saw this play, Chief. You know what I'm about. Chief, you know what I'm about. What's he gonna toxic? Ca calm mine. Yo, I'm physical. Don't you know? I knew he had calm mine, by the way. I totally taunted that thing, turn one. Don't you know? Don't you know I'm physical? Extra physical. Physical. Oh, extra. Oh, physical Lapras, yo. Never heard of him. And he's like, I can't kill, I can't use my Dragonite until I kill this stupid Lapras. And I'm like, I know, right? It's awesome. 
Lapras extra thick. Dazzling Gleam, never heard of it. You're only a plus one, Chief. You're weak. Get that garbage out of here. Another one bites the dust. Adamant Lapras overpowered right now. What's he going to send out? He still has that Mew. He has like Mew. And he has Mega Gyarados. And we have Mega Horn, guys. Get the big Mega Horn. You know I'm going to use Mega Horn like Gyarados if I see it. Oh, you know I'm going to use Mega Horn right the heck now. Show it to me. You better, you, you better got will o Chief. You got will o back there? Yo, a hundred more big bits. Bleed purple bonus, you guys. Oh, he's going for the will o Never lucky. But, guys, put some bitter free emotes up for Elithrad. Going up into the fourth place bit leaderboard for the week. You know, I love seeing it. It's not that, it's actually not that bad of damage. It's not that bad. I think I actually just want to get this thing weak enough to where, like, Mega Aerodactyl come into the game. So, like, I want to see you guys roost. Psychic, yo, that's totally fine, Chief. If I hit this guy one more time, like, Aerodactyl can come in and deal some massive damage. Yes! That's what I'm talking about, yo. You guys think he's gonna roost here? What do you guys think? Narvs, how's it going, friend? Um, another one. He's probably gonna roost here, right? Roost? Yep, so he has Will-O-Wisp, Roost, Psychic, and probably some other, like, maybe, like, Maybe Scald. I wouldn't be surprised to see a Scald. But Mega Horn, as long as we keep hitting these, he should actually just roost. Because he can always end at, like, that percent. Which is a very good percent to be at. But let's see what he goes for. Like, so you could just call a Psychic right here if he wants to. Just to end this right now. But, like, I feel the longer he waits, the more chances I have to miss a Mega Horn. We'll see how he does. He could even switch to Dragonite or something here. He has a lot of good options right now. Yep, just Psychic. That's the right play. That is the right play right now. And we're actually going to send Doug Trio out and have Doug Trio go for... I think I'm going to go for a Stealth Rock. Actually, I'm going to go for an Earthquake first. I want to see what he has. I will see. This, this could go either way. Because he has Dragonite, right? I wonder if I want to get that in right now. Oh, I'm just going to go for the rocks. I could Earthquake, though. Do I like using Stealth Rock Abuse Teams? You may have one on stream recently. I don't really ever abuse the Stealth Rocks. I just send him out and use, like, Stealth Rocks late game. We're going to switch. We're going to use Stealth Rocks right now. And if he wants to go for will o -Wisp right now, I think that's fine. I need the rocks to be able to fight the Gyarados, guys. Yep, there's the will o -Wisp. I should have... Oh, he missed! <gasps> it's my birthday. It's my birthday. Earthquake, baby. We purple bonus 100. That's a Grim Reaper coming for your team. Yo. I don't. It, I did it not work. The bleed purple bonus. Ah oh, shiz. Yo, he double missed it. Oh, are you kidding? Oh my gosh. Hold on. I'm about to try it. Yo, 145 big bits. Yo, I appreciate those. More big bits for Cannon securing that third place bit leaderboard for the week, guys. Put some more bit free emotes up. I love seeing them, guys. I I, I just want to state how much I really, really do love seeing all of those juicy emotes. You guys are so savage every single time. They make my day. Like every night. I, I sit back, relax, and I'm like, oh, I'm so lucky to have, like, a community that just, like, uses these sick emotes. They're so cool, guys. All right, you guys think he's going to roost again? I think he's going to roost again, right? Show me the roost, chief. Show me the roost, chief! Show it to me. Let's see it. Let's see that roost, yo. Show me roost, show me roost, show me roost! Oh! It's time. It's time. It'd be a shame. It'd be a crying shame. If you were encored into that move, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be a crying shame? Conditioned, yes. 100%. Now what do I want to do? I can do whatever the hell I want. I'm just going to use Psychic. Fuck it, you know? I can call mine. I don't want to call mine. I don't have to call mine. I can just literally reapply that roost. Show me a Gyarados switching. You're not switching to Gengar. Show me the Gyarados switching. Show me the Dragonite switching. I got the rocks up too. Show me the Gyarados switching right now. All my, I'll take, I'll take your Dragonite. You literally just donated this Pokemon. You're like, I don't even want it. He was caught off guard by Physical Lapras, and it was that moment. 
He knew he mucked up. Yo, never muck these up. Yo, big damage. Just gonna do another one. Another one. And another one. I was so good. So good. Donations, yo. All Might. Never heard of him. He just gave me that Dragonite. It's like I didn't even want it. And he's gonna go Mega Gyarados, right? He's gonna go with that Omega Gyarados. And he can't use, like, Thunder Wave or Sub, because I'll just, I'll just Encore him. I mean, he could probably Thunder Wave, but if he misses... <sighs> he's just gonna go for Crunch. And I'm gonna switch to... Probably... Venusaur? And I still haven't got Mega, guys. I still have that Aerodactyl. Chillin'. Max and relaxing act all cool. I still have my Dug Trio, too, because he missed two Will-O-Wisps on it. Now, he has that full HP Mew. Mew is definitely a problem, but we also have Aerodactyl with Basar. There's the Gyarados, yo. It's mega time. It's mega. And this is why I didn't want to ever set up or go anything with that. I'm just going to summon with Venusaur. Alright, Venusaur. Move that crunch. Mega drain. Yo, know, equalize it up a little bit. I think I might actually go for like a, a Leech Seed instead. Because it'd be so much better versus like Gengar. I'm thinking about it. I'd be thinking about it. I think, he, I think he should have double switched into me there. That's my opinion. I mean, he has rocks damage up, but like, you gotta, go, you gotta risk for the biscuit sometimes. Don't KO me, please. Now, he has a higher base speed than we do, but I think I'm okay. Let me actually see. Do I have enough bulk to be able to like fight this thing? What do I send out from here? Aerodactyl ain't that bulky. I'll actually just go for the Sleep Powder. Hopefully we outspeed. Please don't be jolly. Oh, oh, we taking these. Sleep Powder, show me that Gengar. Show me that Gengar. Mew, show me, show me this. Yo, we be taking these. Mew? Never heard of me. Sleep Powder. That's right, yo. There's the Mew. That's what I be talking about. Hmm. Do I need this Pokemon for literally anything? I really just don't. I'm just gonna go for Weeks. He can't even wake up this turn. He cannot wake up this turn. Weeks seeds up. Very good. He can wake up next turn. But, like, is he gonna wake up next turn? Making the connections, though. You know it, Chief. You know it. Give me that juicy health back. Do we play greedy? I think I'm gonna play greedy. Are you gonna wake up this turn right now? Wake up. He did wake up. Oof. Never lucky. Never lucky waking up right now. But what he does not know is he's falling right into our trap. He's falling right into our trap, yo. He has not a clue in the world. This is right where I want him. He's gonna go for it. You know he's gonna go for it. The really, really big, uh, what is it? He's gonna go for the big will -O And I want him to will -O me. But I mean, I'll take the KO too. Like we, we also just take KOs here. Like, this is a KO stream. <laughs> we KO, we'll KO the shit out of this Mew if he wants to let us. So, and this is the one time you're ever going to see Mew's Crunch Aerodactyl in singles. Because it works in this team. Meet the best arrow set ever. Yo, you know what I'm talking about. He's going to be like, yes, Will-O-Wisp, I can win. Yep, and he's like, yes, I'm so ahead. He's like, yes, look how ahead I am. And I'm like, chief. Actually, I think, I think his KO is right. Because we have a Leech Seed tick, right? This is why this works, by the way. He's like, yes, I've won. I did it. I'm so, I'm so excited. And I'm like, my guy, I hate to burst your bubble. But it's time. What a different set on Aerodactyl. Oh, you know, we breaking the game here, guys. We changing the game. We changing the rules. I'm changing the rules right now. You send up the Gengar? My like, Gengar still gets two-shotted by Crunch, Chi. Gengar still gets two-shotted by Crunch. Like, let me think about this. Like, Alex Sam can kill that thing literally whenever. Let me just make sure I can play this right. I got Doug Trio still. Oh, I have Doug Trio. I'm okay then. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna crunch it then. It's the crunch time! Yeah. Still should be a two-shot. And he can't go Mega, so he can't get like, the big damage. Look at that. Big damage. Still a two-shot, yo. Shadow Ball. It should not get me low enough. Yo, Willow Miss just got Shiny Cynic Club. 37 eggs. I'll take some bits. Floor Cannon coming in. 510. 
Yo, coming in with the big 510, going up to 1,000 total bits for the week. Second place bit winner board for the week, guys. I want to see 510. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Big bitter free emotes up in chat. Thank you so much. Shiny Cyndaquil. Typhlosion is actually like one of my absolute, absolute favorite Pokemon. I love that thing. I love it. And I think that's so cool. So we take this guy out, but like, look how cool our team is. We used the Encore, we used the Physical Lapras, and we used the Facade Aerodactyl. Like, if we were using a standard team, we probably would have lost this game. But it's that innovation. It's forcing the meta to bend to our will. Making our team, it's the strength of making your team look like it does one thing and then doing something completely different. My team looks like it's so weak to Will-O-Wisp, especially because we're rocking that Adamant Lapras. Like, this is not supposed to KO, but like, look at that damage. Like, Aerodactyls don't do that much damage to Gyaradoses, guys. And then we just set up a board where like, any of my other Pokemon can come in and finish them off, yo. Come in, finish them off, yo. Da 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 Doug Trio. Like, Doug Trio is weak against Will-O-Wisp. Uh, Lapras is weak against Will-O-Wisp. Alakazam is weak against like, Thunder Wave. And Aerodactyl just soaks those things up. And we just rinse and repeat. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Never even heard of it. This guy ain't got no chance. That's what you got. I used all my memes. That formed a hat trick. Yo, fresh. Yo, I don't even... I never even